People form political opinion by talking to each other. And in the 20th century, they would do it around a dining table, around a water cooler, maybe at the market, or over the back fence. But now because of the internet and tools like Facebook and MySpace and YouTube and email, those same conversations that form political opinion are in effect on steroids because the people who are talking to each other about politics are using these tools to communicate not only their opinions but also information that's being given to them directly by the campaigns or that they're taking from the mainstream media. And it's changing the, it's, it's changing the entire media ecology of politics so that our, we're not actually a, living in a world of top-down politics and relying on sound bites from candidates on television or on the radio, but rather we're relying on individuals sharing information, talking to each other, and doing so using the internet as the main uh, platform for political discourse. So what we're seeing in the 2008 presidential campaign is actually the battle between the politics of the 20th century versus the politics of the 21st. And what's at stake is whether or not we're going to build a more robust and participatory democracy.